welcome to Lingua Latina Tutorials with Mr. K. This is chapter 35, Grammatica Latina. Follow along as I read aloud. Grammatica Latina, de declinatione, nomina, pronomina, verba, declinantur, ceterae partes orationes sunt indeclinables. Declinationes nominum sunt quinque. Declinatio prima, genitivus singularis, ai ut terra terrae. Declinatio secunda, genitivus singularis, i ut anus ani verbum verbi. Declinatio tertia, genitivus singularis, is ut solis urbs urbis. Uh, declinatio quarta, genitivus singularis us, ut portus portus, genu genus. Declinatio quinta, genitivus singularis ei, or ei, ut dies di ei, res rei. Declinationes verborum sunt quatuor, conjugationes, quae vocantur. Conjugatio prima, Infinitivus are, ari, ut amare, amari. Conjugatio secunda, infinitivus ere, eri, ut monera, moneri. Conjugatio tertia, infinitivus ere, i, ut legera, legi. Conjugatio quarta, infinitivus ire, iri. Ut audire, audiri. Read through that aloud in Latin and come back and let's translate. Latin grammar uh, concerning declensions. Nouns, pronouns, and verbs are declined. The other parts of speech are indeclinable. The declensions of the nouns are five. There are five declensions. First declension. Genitive singular ends in I, like terra terrae, the earth and of the earth, or the land and of the land. Second declension, genitive singular ends in E, like anus ani, the year of the year, masculine, or verbum verbi, the word of the word, neuter. <coughs> Declinatio tertia, the third declension, genitive singular ends in is, like solis, um, of the, sol solis, the sun and of the sun, and urbs urbis, the city and of the city. The fourth declension, genitive singular us, like portus portus, the port and of the port, or the neuter form, Genu genus, the knee and of the knee. The four, fifth declension, genitive singular, ends in ei or ei, like dies, the day, and dei, of the day, or res, the thing, rei, of the thing. There are four declensions of, of verbs, which are called conjugations. Declension just means a set of endings added to a noun or a verb, and um, the Romans didn't distinguish between the conjugation and declension. They just called the, the verbal endings declensions as well as the noun endings. Conjugatio prima, the first conjugation, infinitive ends in are or ari, active and passive, like to love and to be loved. The second conjugation, infinitive era eri, like to warn and to be warned. Third conjugation, infinitive ura or e, like to read or to be read. Fourth conjugation, infinitive ira or iri, like to listen or to be listened to. So in the margin you see that the declensions are identified by their genitive singular, I, E, Is, Us, and Ei, and the conjugations are identified by their active infinitives, Ara, Era, Ura, and Ira. Read through this a, a third time, aloud in Latin, after you've translated, and then go back to the exercises.